One of our more recent efforts has been to really focus on uh, lymphoma in the elderly. And so we have a poster here that evaluates uh, 300 patients over the age of 80 that have non-Hodgkin lymphoma. And it was a multi-institutional effort between uh, five different Chicago institutions. And uh, we looked to see uh, what kind of uh, treatment they had, whether or not there were any predictors of outcome. And we also uh, retrospectively uh, incorporated a geriatric assessment. So, you know, one of the challenges when we see an elderly patient in our office is, you know, are the risks of the therapy justified? You know, what are the ways that we can decide whether or not this is going to help this patient? And what oncologists have used for a long time is something called performance status, uh, which is just a very, you know, eyeball kind of view. Is this patient fit or not fit? But it turns out that if you do use some of the more sophisticated geriatric scales, you can really tease out some of these elderly patients who... Uh, may actually do very well with aggressive therapy.